Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave your comment below. And also, don't forget to click on the notification bell for more videos. Enjoy your reading. So, guys, this is now a quick recap from our last chapter. By the way, Your Majesty, I would like to contact by the by the. Your Majesty, Commander Gu, what can I do for you? Last night, did you approve my marriage application? It was His Majesty who told me to approve it. <laughs> so His Majesty, he spilled out whatever was in his mouth. Last night, I did receive Commander Gul marriage proposal. At that time, I consulted His Majesty and he asked me to handled it according to the rules and according to the rules the commander and that lady met the condition for marriage so i approved it i will immediately ask baiji to cancel your marriage and then go find that lady to explain so it's just like no need to do that it's okay oh it means no need to explain or no need to divorce. Could it be that my uncle is actually quite satisfied with this marriage? Master, they are just they are just sent a report talking about what is going on. Please deal with it. Forget it, uncle. You go first. Okay. So now he's living. Interesting. It's been so many years and my uncle has never considered getting married. I already have a child, but he's still single. Looks like the tree has bloomed this time. Ah, we send me all the information about that lady right now. Your Majesty, I'm still here. I can send all the information directly to you. Oh, you reminded me that you are still here? My noble majesty, you cannot take personal revenge on professional ground, right? Xiaowan, because of you. So we are back to the lady. Our parents are getting married, so the brother is blaming her. Like because of her, the parents are getting divorce that can't be blamed on me why don't you blame Ho Yi Chang and Su Wan that was an accident Xiao Man was in hurry to attend to wedding so the accident happened if it wasn't for Yi Chang rescuing her in time she might have died stop fighting this is our uh, 
uh, someone coming god i can stop again Suman, the Su family's adopted do daughter. So she's the girl, the problematic person here. It's all my fault. Xiaoman, why are you here? Your injuries. Second brother, please go first. I'm fine. I have something to talk to my sister alone. Okay. So now he left. Sister, I'm really sorry. So they can have that conversation. No one, none of us wanted things to turn out like this. I don't ask you to forgive me. Xiao, she's just looking at her. I just hope you don't get mad at her. Hua is Wei Chang. Is it okay? Friend, Xiaoman, do you smell something? What? Such a strong smell. Such a strong smell of green tea. So it's smelling green tea lies. That's all for this chapter. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave your comment below. And also don't forget to click on the notification bell for more videos. Bye!